Welcome back to Underplayed as we continue our playthrough of Asteri and Abli 2 Mission Las Vegas. Although we're changing things up on you a bit here. Uh, we are actually playing Asteri and Abli 2 um, uh, Mission We Fix. This is the PSP port of uh, Asteri and Abli 2. Uh, and we are playing that on the PPSS PP emulator uh, for PC. So it's very complicated. Lots of letters I'm just throwing out in, in seemingly random orders. Um, why are we doing this? Well, first of all, trying to make sure we have our, our music working okay. There we go. Uh, the reason we're doing this is because the PC version, which we were playing before, which played through the first couple of segments. Huh. We both had to push on this. We may just uh, obviously is good enough for this. Um... Uh, the the original PC version has no support for uh, widescreen formats, so everything was kind of stretched out a bit. Um, and by playing the PSP version, we are able to actually upscale it to a full widescreen resolution, and everything looks much better. Everything is the proper uh, proportion now. So uh, I apologize for the bait and switch, as it were. Woohoo! Just got a multiplier. Oh, I can multiply it even more. Look at that. Oh, yeah. So many helmets. Look at that. Oh, so many helmets. Oh, let's smash some stuff up. Get as big a multiplier as we can get. Yeah. All right. So, yeah, the uh, the first several segments of this gameplay uh, series have been uh, on the PC version, and we are now transitioning to the PSP version using the PS SSP emulator, as I just said. Um, let's see, I need something in order to get to that cage. I can't really tell what. Um, the other reason for this is uh, sometimes it's just more interesting to um, to kind of test the limits of what emulators can pull off. I've noticed that a lot of the the gameplay series that we've done on Underplayed. Um, those gameplay videos that have focused more on emulated software have tended to be some of the more popular ones. Uh, just because, I, I don't know, I, th I think it's more interesting to uh, to view emulation as a hobby and uh, and see how far you can take it, you know? Alright. So, there's some posters here for Larry Craft. I don't really, uh, not really sure I, I get the reference. This game is a very uh, reference-heavy game. We, as we pointed out before, we saw the uh, the references to Sly Cooper and Super Mario Sunshine and uh, some, what else? What else? Uh, Yoshi, uh, Bomberman, Splinter Cell—just ridiculous amounts of video game references, which are absolutely hilarious. Um, oh, look out! Oh, come on! And here, triangle. Triangle. Huh, I'm not sure if I'm doing these things right. Oh, that little Super Mario guy is getting me good. Alright, circle. Circle. Why oh, is this not working? I don't, I don't get what the, uh, the little booster thing was trying to get me to do there. Alright, so once again. Circle, triangle. Nope. Pretty sweet music in this game, though. Check that out. It's kind of a this kind of weird techno uh, whale thing going on. All right, switch to him and we get some extra stuff by fighting enemies a certain way. Triangle. All right, hang on. O triangle square. O triangle. What? 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 Missing here? I don't understand. O triangle. Square. Uh, I, I, I don't understand what the uh, the combo system is supposed to be here. I am I am pressing the buttons that are coming up, and uh, I'm not getting the rewards that I've been promised. It's very frustrating. Ah. All right. Is that everybody? Nope. We got one more here. Looks like we need uh, Abli to. There we go. Okay, I see. I think it has to be um, a specific enemy that we're fighting that has the special little extra bonus icon over their heads. All right. 
So there's a new guy with a present over his head for a plus 10 multiplier. If I can get to it. Camera controls are a little bit wonky uh, because we're playing the PSP version. So that means no analog sticks. Um, although if I recall correctly, the camera controls in the PC version were a little bit weird too. Oh, what? Hang on. Let's push back to it. I gotta find this guy and it's square. Did I not get it? I'm just getting my butt whooped. Darn. I think I had to reset. I think that uh, I missed one of the combo presses, and instead of resetting the, the combo instructions, it just continued to, like, stick on the last one that I missed. All right. So, I believe, what can you do here? Triangle, go on. Try. Ah! All right, I'm just going to go go back to wailing on everything. Let's take this guy out first because he's uh, pretty annoying with his ranged attacks. All right. Now, where's this present guy? Okay, that's everyone, I think. Beat this basket to get some food, restore health. Oh, we got one. Still got more to fight. Wow. All right. Switch to him. Oh, cool. He's going to give us a uh, plus 10 multiplier if we can get his present thing off. Get him! Get him! Yeah! Get that one, too. Uh, get that thing before I... Ah, oh, I missed it. All right, I think you're legitimately the last one. Nope, maybe not. Are they just infinitely spawning enemies? Is that what this is? I. There we go. Yeah, it seems like we're facing the same enemies over and over. Uh, maybe I'm missing something here. Maybe we're supposed to be uh, actually uh, doing something to stop them from spawning. I don't, I'm not sure. Or maybe it's just like a ridiculous amount of enemies. Heal up a little bit. And what do we have here? We got a we got a door with a lock on it. Not getting through there. We got this Mario dude. We got a power up. Have we won yet? Keep on pushing this block. Hey, okay. right, green potion. What does that do? Push it. Push it. Or can only I believe push things. Uh, he's getting poked instead of pushing. Switch back to our friend over here. Out up here for a second. I don't think the bad guys can get us from here. This gives us a chance to survey the battlefield, see what's actually going on here. Is it that I just need to actually perform the present, the uh, the combo thing, enough times, or what? All right, I think we I think we've killed zillions of soldiers. We should be. Uh, should have proved our worth by now. Come on. What's going on, you guys? Will they follow us all the way back here if we go back over this way? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. We have uh, this this thing right here. There we go. Now, I, I guess I just have to eliminate these guys long enough for me to drag the uh, the platform over, right? Get out of here, you guys. Get out of here. What are you doing? All right. 
heal up a little bit. Oh, apparently those baskets are not infinite health. Alright. Oh, look out. We got more bad guys. Oh, look out. Look out. Look out. Ah! Okay, I understand now. So, we do seem to have infinitely spawning bad guys. And unfortunately, I've wasted all of my health pickups <laughs> without realizing that. Um, dang it. You know what, let's, uh, let's switch to, I believe we can. Um, let's see if we can go this opposite way. It's kind of actually pretty hard. It's not like hard from a... From a challenging standpoint, it's just kind of a frustratingly difficult mechanic, you know? Um, having to... Uh, I can't switch while he's up there. i got to get him back down here. I'm having a really hard time getting uh, the, the field clear enough, long enough for us to do that. It's rather frustrating. All right. Okay, let's get him back down over here real quick before the guards catch up with us a little more time. I'll go explore across that bridge, maybe. Okay. Yeah, let's go over here and just ignore that for now. Um, but in the meantime... Woohoo! A 50-time multiplier! Look at that! Grab as many of these goodies as we can. <laughs> 